Welcome back to Rob's Garage Woodworking. Today, I'm tearing down this abomination. Um, it's sort of a lean-to type shed that's close to the garage, like close to the garage, but not really touching it. So water kind of pours down in and around it and under it. And it's not really, well, it looks like it's sitting on dirt. It's not made properly at all. And it's kind of a, a beehive, really. A wasp trap more than anything. So we're gonna pull it down. That's what I'm doing today. And uh, anyway, I've taken the door off. I've taken some of the crap out from inside. Taken some of the siding off. And that's what I'm working on now, is taking off the siding. I'm gonna start up there and work my way down, it looks like. Anyway, um, so I've got a pile of scrap metal, some of that stuff over here, the door was actually over there that was on it. I'm going to scrap that. Um, anyway, that's about it. This is my Sunday afternoon. Tear down a crappy shed. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, you can tell by the construction that you know, it's not quite right. Somebody spent a lot of time on it. Alright, so as you can see here, it wasn't really built properly. Um, he owned a uh, brad nailer. And that's how I put this shed together with brad nails. See, everywhere, brad nails. A lot of this stuff was put together with brad nails too. And then some screws as well. But anyway, which makes it nice because it's easy to take apart. I just have to push on it and all comes out. That's recording. You ready for this? Yeah, back up over here. All right, now YouTube. Stand there, it's gonna come towards we you. are going to be taking down this oh, lovely yeah. building. Are you your combatants? <laughs> With the dog's leash, the dog's chain. Okay, you guys ready? So okay, ready. Move over there so you can see it. Move over there. All right. Oh. What about your gas line? Yes, but it, the other thing's pulling on it. <laughs> and our wild beast. Do an inventory of the damage. As you can see, it is no longer attached to the wall. It was never attached to the wall. That's the funny part. Okay, back up. And it's uh, looking pretty structurally sound. It's not attached to the wall either? No, it's not attached to anything. Well, no, it's just that it's pulling on the line. Like the whole thing is making that sense. Well, there. Heads up. Wait, I want to do that. It looks fun. <laughs> so it comes down. Whoa! Four. First casualty. Uh, it really is how good with that is. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready? Look at that. Okay. This should come down pretty easily now. The this face of victory. Man one structure zero. <laughs> one wow. structure zero. What a piece of shit. Hey. Hey. Stop. She's <laughs> chewing on your boots. Hey. Alright. Hey. So, here you go. You want to see something funny? Brad nails. Brad nails, Brad nails, Brad nails. Holding the whole thing together. So, anyway. That's that piece of ugliness away. I just got to clean up. Okay. It's recording now, right? Yeah, it's got the little square thing in the middle. Yeah, okay. All right, come on over here. So, this guy was such a scavenger that he used... Okay, back up. This guy was such a scavenger that he used to reinforce the corners. Door strikers. These are door strikers. 
Oh, you oh my goodness. Yeah, he used door strikers on both sides. I say it worked. Well, yeah, or you could just use the proper hardware instead of door strikers. Called thinking outside the box. He's thinking something. That's for sure. He's thinking, oh, I'm so drunk. That's what he's thinking. <laughs> it kind of like they look like they, you know, fit really well. <laughs> Wow. That's funny. Okay, and and of course it wasn't on any proper base. He threw a bunch of dirt and gravel down. It's not even full gravel. I'm 100% sure he's just doing this to cover up a grave. <laughs> Maybe. We'll see. That's we'll big let the dog. For a person, right? We'll let the dog dig and find. <laughs> find maybe his Some ex wife bones. or something. Anyway, yeah, that's it. Sheds down. I took like a couple hours. Thanks, crew. Yeah. Well, so that's it. That's all that's left over. You got a big pile of wood. This is like some kind of fancy pressure treated wood. Um, it's really good. I don't know, whatever it is. Almost like a plastic injection. Really tough stuff. And we have the door, some leftover tin, and then that's my other pile of scrap that has to go. Got a scrap guy that's got to come and pick that up, and we have the leftover roof, and then uh, that's it. That's where it was. You can see the dirty outline where it sat. All gone. All in an afternoon's work. All right. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. That's uh, that's all I'm doing today. Beer time.